Hi, I'm Rebecca from Little Events Shop and in this video I'm going to help you decide how to dress your kids for forest school. In the winter when it's cold you're more concerned about keeping them warm and dry and my friend Millie here is going to show you how. Okay, so the first thing you need to think about is what you're going to put on your what we call the base layer for your child, the clothing they're going to wear next to the skin. What you want to do is avoid anything cottony and go with something synthetic like we've got here. We've got a really nice, is it snuggly top, Millie? Yeah, nice snuggly top and thermal bottoms as well. And they're made from um, polyester, so they wash really easily. They're really quick drying. And also on her feet here, we've got, actually we've got ski socks, which are quite nice for forest school because they come right up and they're not going to slide down when the children are wearing wellies. So we'd recommend wearing for, um, ski socks. And if you've got some, get some wool content in them, that again will help with the warmth. Okay, so once you've sorted the base layer out, we want to get the mid layer right. So here we've got fleece. So Millie's wearing a lovely fleece jacket which has got a nice big zip, so you can zip it up and down as you need to keep yourself nice and warm. And fleece trousers as well. Fleece trousers are excellent for keeping, um, keeping the legs warm um, for children in the winter when they're running around in forest school. Again, like the base layers, they're all made of um, synthetic fabric, so they're easy to wash and easy to care for. Okay, so we've got our, the base layer sorted and the fleece layer, mid layer sorted, and now we're going to make sure Millie's nice and dry. So she's got waterproof dungarees on, which are brilliant because they come right up to here. So this whole area is fully protected and waterproof um, and provides a lot of protection even without a jacket. And then when it gets colder and more wet, you put the jacket on top. The Slaskerman here, the Didrikson Slaskerman, comes with poppers. So they're quite nice and easy for children to put on themselves and quick to take them off when they need to go to the loo. Um, so yep, so we're warm and dry. And now we just need the final touches. Okay, so now we've put the finishing touches on. Millie's fully ready for the wettest, windiest, grottiest day at Forest School. So we've popped on some waterproof mittens. Make sure they're waterproof. These are called Didrikson's Pile Gloves. They're, again, very good, fully waterproof with some um, fleece insulation as well. And they come up nice and high, so they're quite e difficult for the children just to, to pull off or accidentally drop. Um, we've also got a nice beanie, Millie, haven't we? And then the finishing touch, which is really handy and a lot of people overlook, is just a little fleece neck gaiter or neck warmer that just sits in there and blocks out all the, uh, all the drafts. So you're, you're all set to go. Yes, happy? Great. <laughs> 